All right, so those were just my Ritz crackers in my springform pan. Now we're gonna put this to the side and we are going to grab a bowl that I popped in the freezer for just a few minutes. And I have here some heavy whipping cream. Go ahead and get this baby open. And we're gonna put a few cups of heavy whipping cream right into our bowl. Perfect, so we did about half a liter of our heavy whipping cream. And we're not gonna add anything extra to this mixture. We're just gonna start off with the heavy whipping cream. I have my hand mixer here and we are gonna whip this heavy whipping cream up. We want it to be like a whipped cream, but I'm gonna go for a, a thicker, kind of like an over beaded whipped cream, more like a get meringue than a whipped cream. So let's get this nice and thickened. Okay, this is looking nice and thick and beautiful. Let's go ahead and get all that access off of our beaters, put these to the side. Okay, so we are gonna make this a salted caramel whipped cream. And we're gonna just drizzle a little bit right on top of our whipped cream, just like so. Okay, and we're gonna fold in that caramel, try to get it throughout our entire bowl of whipped cream. Should be, you know, a nice buttery color once we're done folding it in. You wanna make sure to fold and not mix because we wanna make sure it's nice and fluffy and that caramel doesn't flatten our delicious homemade whipped cream. All right, so I don't know if you can tell on camera, but it is a little off white, which is exactly what we're looking for. You don't wanna add too much caramel. We're gonna bring back in our springform pan with the Ritz crackers and we are gonna do a nice layer of our caramel whipped cream on top of those Ritz crackers. Now, if you don't like Ritz crackers, you could use a cookie, you could use graham crackers, but I just find that the Ritz crackers are a nice salty addition for our salted caramel treat. That looks good. And now we're gonna just use our spatula to flatten out our whipped cream softly without moving our Ritz crackers. It doesn't need to be fully flattened out. Just make sure it gets from edge to edge or from round to round, whatever you guys wanna call that. And we're making such an easy and delicious no-bake dessert, perfect for the springtime or the summertime, however you wanna make it. I think this is a great dessert for Easter. The kids love it and you will too. All right, now we're gonna grab some more Ritz crackers and we are gonna do another layer of Ritz crackers right on top of that delicious salted caramel whipped cream. And you guessed it, we are gonna do another layer of whipped cream and we're just gonna continue our layers until our springform pan is full. Okay, so we did three layers of Ritz crackers and three layers of our whipped topping. Now I'm gonna come in with that salted caramel that we put in the whipped topping and we are gonna do a nice layer of this right on top. Just kind of get it pretty on top. Just like so. It doesn't need to go all the way to the edge, but if you like caramel, you can make it go all the way to the edge. And you can use regular caramel if you don't like salted. Now, a little fun optional touch. I'm adding my fleur de sel, which is, you know, uh, just a top topping salt. Put a little bit in my hand, just like that. You don't need much and just sprinkle it right on top of that caramel for extra saltiness. Now, if you like salted caramel, you will love this dessert. Beautiful. All right, we're gonna go ahead and put our dessert in the freezer for four hours. Really let those crackers soak in that whipped topping. Hey you guys, it's been four hours. Let's go ahead and look at this bottom. Get those little Ritz crackers down there. Ooh, I'm so excited to try this. Okay, let's go ahead and take our little thing and just run it across the side of our dessert so that our thing doesn't stick to our dessert. All right. Oh. Time for the reveal. Ooh. 
Look how beautiful that came out. Oh my goodness. Okay, I think it's time to cut a slice, right? Yeah, I think so. All right, I'm gonna cut one right here. Can't wait to see those layers. Oh, it cut perfect. You ready? I think so. Look at that. Doesn't that look so good? Oh, it's perfect. Our little ice box caramel Ritz cracker cake. Oh yeah. It's like an ice cream cake. I don't know if you guys do this, but heavy cream, when you whip it up and freeze it, it's ice cream. <laughs> Salty and sweet, my favorite combo. Mm. That is incredible. Oh my God, look at it, it's solid, you guys.